Watch. What we've learned about yachting from below deck. A below deck Mediterranean chief stew just said I do. That's right. Hannah Ferrier is now married, E! News can exclusively reveal. The reality TV star wed her partner of nearly four years, Josh Roberts, on March 26 in a boat IFUL ceremony in Australia on Sydney's northern beaches. The bride wore a Villani bridal gown. Josh, meanwhile, honored his Scottish roots by wearing a kilt. His three groomsmen and Hannah's father also sported the traditional garb. The couple's 16-month-old daughter Ava Grace Roberts was naturally involved with their special day as one of their two flower girls. In an exclusive interview with News Before the Big Day, Hannah revealed that her little one would be walking down the aisle in a gorgeous little flower crown with some assistance. From Hannah's mom, guests sipped on Gerard Bertrand Cote de Rose's rosé wine at the wedding, which featured floral arrangements by Flower Wanderer and music from Nicole Rose. Kashea, wedding planner. The ceremony itself was officiated by an amazing local celebrant named Caroline, Hannah said. She's just been fantastic. She's so warm and kind but she alsorily understands our humor. That, and the need to avoid a stiff ceremony, she added. I think even in the speech that she gives before she marries us. Thath words margarita and tequila come up like twice. Caroline also told Hannah and Josh's guests their love story, which the Bravo alum said began in a Sydney bar after she wrapped filming on season 4 of Below Deck Med. We had a glass of wine and then we went for dinner the next night, Hannah recalled, and then we caught up for drinks after the races the night after that. And then we just spent, like, seven days seeing each other for something each day. Once they finally made the decision to spend an evening apart, Hannah said they still wound up watching the same TV show and texting about it the whole night. Josh wasn't yet aware that she was a TV star herself, but when she did get around to telling him, the whole thing was no big deal. As Josh told E! News, I think she's pretty much who she is on the show, but it is obviously a show. Keep scrolling to get an inside look at Hannah and Josh's big day. Smiling bride. The kiss. The bride and groom. The wedding party. Cheers. Congratulations. Hannah was unceremoniously dismissed from below deck med after season 5, but she quickly set sail on a new adventure. Motherhood. She and Josh welcomed Ava in. 2020, shortly after they celebrated their two-year anniversary. Now, Ava is nearly two years old herself. She's just started speaking, which is so cute, Hannah said, revealing that her first word was bubbles. But being the parent of a young daughter while planning a wedding, and running the Ocean International Training Academy, ISNT Easy. Hannah described her, days ashectic, adding, we had, basically, a disaster wedding planner who took on our wedding and then did nothing for six weeks. So this whole wedding has, been planned in the last four weeks. Yes, four weeks. Hannah noted that Josh initially wanted to scale it all back, but she didn't want to give up on her dream wedding. Luckily, she quickly found a new planner and together, their sheer determination started making things happen. The reception was ultimately held at Hannah and Josh's home. Some of her former Below Deck Med co-stars were in attendance, including Anastasia Sermava, who recently go engaged herself. Now that they've said I do, the couple will soon head to Thailand for their honeymoon, where their main goal is to relax. Everyone's like, oh, the nightclubs are open. Hannah said, I am like, are you f king kidding me? We have a baby. We don't want to go to nightclubs. We want to take a nap. At this point, it's well deserved. Catch more of Hannah by streaming past seasons of Below Deck Mediterranean on Peacock. E. Bravo and Peacock are all part of the NBC Universal family.